I got a text from my mum asking about internship applications because I've sent off a couple. Good morning, it's Thursday. So my timetable for today is I have a number theory lecture in the morning and then in the afternoon I've got a statistics lecture a meeting and an hour where I need to be available along with a few other students um, in case first years have problems with their tutorial sheets and they can come and ask us. So that's the plan for today. I want someone to start walking towards us. Okay. Hey guys, what's up? So we're on our way to our first lecture and we need to hand in our coursework that we did the online submission for last night. After this, Callum has talked me into <laughs> eating at the Grove, which is like a little restaurant diner thing on campus, because all my flatmates are terrible influences. <laughs> Tom's shaming us all by bringing his work in here. How's it going, Tom? Oh, and Cassie's got her work out too. Oh boy. She's not doing I'm just reading over the things because I'm Oh, I need to do that as well. Okay, if you get work out, I'm not going to. I've no idea what these two are doing. Oh. <laughs> I don't want it to rhetorical question. Uh. <laughs> I haven't had a milkshake here since like first year. I haven't had a milkshake here. Yeah, okay, let's not do magnetic fields. No. <laughs> I'm so pumped for this. I'm gonna down all of this. It's gonna be so full of carbs. It's gonna be amazing. So I'm finished with lectures for the day, just on my way back. The weather is miserable, but I'm very excited because my dad is coming to visit and I'm meeting him soon to go out for dinner. Hello. Good, how are you? 
Okay, so I just met up with my dad and he brought me some food things that are a bit harder to get in shops around here. Like, I eat puffed wheat a lot. I know it's the most boring cereal ever, but I really like it. So, um, but you can't get it in the supermarkets I've got around here. So he brought me a couple of boxes of that. Yeah, except that my room was already a state and now I've just brought in these extra bags and just, I can't even walk into my room right now. That's what my entryway looks like right now. Tomorrow, I'm gonna tidy my room. So I was just sat in my room earlier in the gap between my morning and afternoon lectures, just watching Netflix, minding my own business, having a good time. And I got a text from my mum asking about internship applications because I've sent off a couple. Um, and she was saying how one of them, the deadline is today and asking me if I'd sent it off. And I was like, yeah, I sent that off weeks ago because I did, I did all the CV and filling out everything. And I sent that off a few weeks ago you send off your application and assuming you meet like the kind of minimum requirements like usually you need to be predicted a 2-1 or above and uh, have certain A-level grades but assuming you meet those requirements they'll send you an email saying you need to do these aptitude tests and I knew I hadn't done the aptitude tests yet so I just went back and checked um, because you don't have to do those straight away, you just need to do them before the deadline. And yeah, I, need, I still need to do those aptitude tests, and I just completely forgot about it. So um, it's now the last possible day to do it, and it's about 9 o'clock in the evening. But it says it's only like a 20 or 30 minute thing. Basically what it is, is you just do, um, there's usually like a numerical reasoning test, a verbal reasoning test, sometimes there'll be like a situational workplace kind of test which is just they'll give you different scenarios and I'll be like this is something that could happen to you while you're working here, what would you do in this situation? The actual content is really basic but it's a very pressured time situation so you just have like a certain amount of seconds to read this question, do the calculation or do the verbal reasoning or whatever, decide on an answer, that kind of thing. So um, yeah, it's not like difficult stuff, it's just time pressured. And I completely forgot about those, so <laughs> the deadline's today, I need to get those tests done. That is what I'm gonna be doing for the next 20 minutes, half an hour. Okay, aptitude tests done. Um, I'm not allowed to say what was actually on them, but if you are a student and you're applying to internships, a lot of companies will have practice tests you can take that I would recommend doing before you do the actual thing, just so you have like, an idea of what they're going to ask you, what kind of questions and stuff. So, um, yeah, that was fun, all done, and I'm free to enjoy the rest of this evening because I don't have any coursework. <gasps> this is such a rare occasion. What am I going to do? I think now that I have a free evening for the first time in I don't even know how many weeks I am going to try and get some editing done because I actually really like doing that but I just haven't had time for the last couple of weeks and yeah just have a nice chill evening in without having to do any coursework. Okay so it's been about five minutes and my flatmate just texted me asking if I'm going to the gym which I am meant to and um i need to go to bed now if i want eight hours of sleep before six o'clock tomorrow morning so r.i.p my free evening but um it's okay because tomorrow i literally have one single lecture this week because sometimes i have other things but um they alternate weeks and they're not on this week so just one hour tomorrow that i need to be on campus and the whole rest of the day is free so um, yeah, I'm going to bed right now so that I can be up tomorrow morning at six, bright and early, well, dark and early because um, it's winter and I'll see you then.